None are so blind that they refuse to see. Translates those who are too stupid to see what is right in front of them. Your sense of sight, folks, is not your only sense. How's it going? Today's Wednesday, November 19th, 2014. To the 5 million undocumented workers, to the 5 million undocumented persons residing within the United States of America, I have a message for you. This video is addressed to you. I have been hashing it out and thinking about it and, and wondering how all of this is going to play out with the executive orders that Barack Obama is going to ultimately sign, either orders, plural, or if it is a singular order that he, you know, will sign, ensuring your place here in the United States and preventing your deportation. And look, because I know something. I know you love this country. I know you do. I know you love this country as I. I love this country, despite all of the harm and all of the bad shit that has occurred over the past several decades. And I've been hashing it out and trying to come up with a uh, sort of logical, you know, reason why now. And it hit me like a ton of bricks, right? You see, the day that Barack Obama announces his executive order orders, which could come as early as tomorrow, Thursday, the 20th or Friday, he has a speaking engagement in Las Vegas uh, with Joe Biden on Friday the 21st. That day will be marked as your day. And what's going to follow that day is the grand jury's acquittal of Darren Wilson, that will come shortly thereafter. You see, your day is going to be marked by bloodshed with bloodshed and violence. And I'm not talking about, you know, tea party years and right wingers going out into the streets because they, you know, they're against the executive order. No, no, no. I'm talking about all TV cameras will be focused in Ferguson. Days after the president announces your place in this country. Do you understand that in as much as American citizens' rights are being trampled every day? For you people that are here undocumented, they're just slapping you across the face. They're laughing. They're mocking you. Your day, not for naught. Buried, drowned out by President Barack Obama and everybody who lobbied for this. I think a message should be sent, and I think it's incumbent upon all of you people to send a very clear-cut, extreme, thought-provoking message to the President of the United States of America, Barack Obama. Because these people, folks, they only understand, people like Obama, understand only the extreme ways of getting things done in this country. And I think that he is going to drown out your day, folks, by all the nonsense going on in Ferguson, Missouri, should really have you scratching your heads. 
as to who it is that these people really care about because they don't give a shit about you. They never gave a shit about you. Ever. It's incumbent upon all of you to care and give a shit about yourselves. Why don't you stop going along to get along? Why don't you stop, you know, giving in to these people? and their methods of pushing you in one direction or another and start thinking for yourselves because you are in this with us. You're not in it with them. Do you understand what I'm telling you? One of the most marked day in American history is coming up soon with regard to immigration reform. And I'm telling you as I sit here, it will be drowned out by the announcement of Darren Wilson's innocence, non-guilt. Is that what you people want? I wouldn't think so. I would think you would want and expect a whole lot more out of this administration. You know, think about it. Y'all take it easy. Peace.